Hey everybody, Wanna Weasem here. Just made a tweet that I had gotten back on Mario Kart 8 with the new DLC packs. They're new to me, because we never played them uh, when we got them, because we had so many issues with Nintendo uploads. And I've explained all that in part 11. I'm not going to explain it here. Uh, it's very sad, it's very annoying, it's very frustrating, it ticks me off. It's one of the, it takes a lot to tick me off, and it's usually about something I care about. And, uh, Mar Nintendo games, Mario games in particular, especially Mario Kart, falls into that category where I would be uh, more sensitive to. So, uh, if you want to know the story there, go back to part 11. <laughs> and, uh, long story short, what you need to know here... I hadn't played the game in forever. That's why we've never played uh, <laughs> these parts 11 and 12, if you will. Uh, we're into, when we left off, we were at part 19, we were in the 100cc stuff, and I skipped two sections, parts 11 and 12, because I knew DLC Pack 2 was coming out, and so this is going to go back into place, kind of be like retro added, if you will. But uh, I didn't know the controls <laughs> when we started back here in part 11. For the life of me, I, I thought ZR was Accelerate, and I don't know why it isn't. That makes just a ton of sense to me. Uh, I might look in to see if that's something that I can switch to, in all honesty. But uh, we're going to go ahead and get on the ball here. <laughs> and uh, we're going to do Grand Prix. Uh, 50cc, you can see there, we just did the Crossing Cup. We three-starred that bad boy, even though we hadn't played. Uh, my favorite track in that one was the Animal Crossing one. Uh, very, very cool. But uh, we'll go 50cc, and we played as Villager last time, so let's go with Isabel. Oh, we don't get to pick Fall or Summer Outfit, do we? Okay. New cart. Flame Rider. Very cool. Uh, do we have new carts from this DLC pack? I think we do. Okay, so uh, there was the Master Cycle. This is from uh, DLC pack 2, I believe, the City Tripper. And then we also have the Bone Rattler. Was that one? Might have been new. Uh, no. I, again, I used to know this stuff hands down, and then <laughs> I got really disheartened. But, uh... Ooh. Anyway, let's go with uh, Standard Cart, because that's, that's how I rule. After that, we'll do the cool, like, City Tripper, things of that nature. Uh, wheels, let's see what we have new here. GLA tires, Triforce tires, Leaf tires, that's very Animal Crossing-like. Background on them. We'll go standard. <laughs> and, uh, Hylian Kite, nice. Animal Crossing paper glider. You know what, we'll rock that one. Okay, it looks good with this build. Alright, so again, we just did the Crossing Cup, the Animal Crossing track there at the bottom. Awesome. I uh, absolutely loved it. We played the whole thing in summer. So I don't quite... I remember people saying, like, it changes every time, and I didn't know if they meant laps. Uh, there are not four laps, there's only three, so I'm assuming it's each time you play it. Because we clearly would have just done summer, not spring, because it does have the cherry blossoms, like I had mentioned. So, uh, that'll give us something to look forward to. Wild Woods was kind of cool, although it looked more like a toad village than a shy guy world, but... Uh, I don't know, maybe there were two, I just mainly saw Shy Guys, so... Here we go, it's the Bell Cup. <laughs> and, uh, we're gonna see what goes down here. Neil Bowser City was pretty cool, although it's been a long time since I played it. Ribbon Road, I don't believe I've ever raced on that, and I'm pretty confident it's not been in any other game since then. Super Bell Subway will be new. <laughs> I have no idea what to expect there in Big Blue. I'm not sure either, so... Uh, again, my apologies on the lack of knowledge here. I used to know this stuff, and then I got 100% burned out. So, we're just going to start it, hope for the best, and try to have some fun here. So, And like I said, if all this hits the fan and I can't upload Nintendo stuff anymore, because this is really their last chance with me, uh, I'll either do a second channel where I'm going to send, you know, stream archives to, or... Uh, it'll just all be on Twitch. I'll kind of, you know, gauge your input on that. And what I mean by there is it will not be exported at all. <laughs> you know, so... Anyway, I remember this track, but not well. So... And we're behind... Oh, jeez, I was accelerating with ZR again. Freaking A. 
I wish I could just get rid of the baby character. Oh, is that baby? No, that's Wendy. I'm cool with Wendy being ahead of this. How did we pass? Oh, I was going to say, she totally used her mushroom. I remember there's also a very sharp turn somewhere on this track that I always like cut into the wall. Hammer bro? I don't remember him being a 3DS man. I'll have to go back and play that, but can I pull new leaf? I don't know that I can. That hammer bro kind of looked like a coin to me. Somewhere on this track though, it's a very sharp corner. There's one that I go into the wall and one that I sail off. I think that's where I sail off. <laughs> And then uh, there is one though where I hit the wall frequently. This is our zero gravity section. Come on, Isabella. It's weird seeing Isabella not like having the you know, which outfit of Isabella would you like? Do you want summer Isabella or fall Isabella? <laughs> you know. I guess it's spring and fall, right? That was poor timing. Not on our part. Sometimes I wish that there was a way to just do this like based on driver skill and see how bad you could beat like the CPUs in 50cc. And it would be like a competition. <laughs> you know, like, yeah, I lapped Baby Daisy, you know, or something along those lines would be interesting. And where this gets you, I remember from the 3DS, you saw like the safety rails there to the left side. They're not here on this portion. <laughs> and so, if you get accustomed to like gliding into those on a long drift or something, you get shafted right there. So you gotta watch that. What's cool about this one is the uh, precipitation. It's very need for speedish. You know. I always like to put banana peels in front of the uh, ramps for some reason. The Mario Kart Wii coconut mall type tactic works flawlessly. There's almost guaranteed success. I want to know if, oh my gosh, our own shell got us. Dang. <laughs> but I tell you what, if uh, ZL was looked behind, that would just be masterful placement. I don't know, it might not work well for someone with smaller hands, but if you're like me, you basically have like a thumb cramp this entire time because I rarely let off <laughs> uh, the gas. You know? so, except here, I've learned over all my... T and it's really bad on the 3DS there because you can't, like, you know, your uh, C-stick kind of... Like, come on. I'm trying to figure out why that said 4 above it. It's sort of like today's mystery. There's my banana. And we're gonna sail in for the victory. Smooth moves, Isabel. Smooth moves. Let's see who we got in here. So we got the Chick Villager. That's interesting. Uh, oh, it's a chickathon here for Valentine's Day. Isabel, Windy, and Villager. Uh, middle Mario holding his own Limmy, representing the Koopalings. We got four Koopalings in this, too. Uh, Baby Peach, winner of the Babies Mario, up your game. Tanuki Mario, Roy, and in last place, where she belongs, it's Baby Daisy. Next race. <laughs> what was this one? It was a GB8 Ribbon Road, I think. Sounds familiar, but I don't believe I've seen it rehash. You know, used to, they'd never rehash one. Wait, have I played this? I don't know, but it looks pretty good. And <laughs> they put in their Kinect toys. Ooh, that's crafty. Ooh, look at the wallpaper, though. That's updated. Again, I was about to accelerate with the wrong button, because it's the one that makes so much sense. Let's do this, Isabel. Man, we passed Wendy that uh, first lap in the old Bowser City. I never saw her again. Did she throw the... Oh, I thought she had already thrown it. That could have been bad. Huh. Super Mario World stuff here. Okay, so we... Lots of stuff, ooh, lots of nods to different games here. Well done, Nintendo. The clown car. <laughs> it's kind of funky. The paper glider seems to have like a bit more transparency to it than the others. 
Guess we'll just hang on to the green shell for a while. Killed in play. Oh, I thought I had tin coins already. Always want to have tin coins when possible because you get a slight spin. A lot of people don't seem to know that. It's like, oh, you just unlock stuff, man. It's not a big deal. Well, it actually is because you have slightly higher top speed. So. Is that a yarn, Yoshi? Ah, it is. This would have been out a long time before Yarn Yoshi, so that's interesting. Oh, it was a blue shell, no. Oh, horrible. Well, thank you, Lakitu. We just got OP treatment there. I see no one behind us. That's excellent news. <laughs> Alright, so, final lap here. Cute video. I feel like when Isabel wins a race, she should say, Congratulations, Mayor of Wisdom. <laughs> you know? You did it. The citizens are so proud of you. Alright. I could see this being like uh, with friends, or I guess that's a little ramp you can take to the side. That would be a significant shortcut, wouldn't it? I thought I'd placed a banana before that. But, uh,. I see oh yeah, man! <laughs> I was gonna say, I could see this being like a big problematic track uh, with a lot of people or like a higher CC level uh, just for the fact that there's so many places you could get hit and knocked off and made very miserable. So, it kinda started to catch up with us there. So it was windy again, she appears to be competitor number one. Uh, Iggy and Villager fighting. Uh, really? Uh, three through six is pretty tight there. Uh, here it's uh, you can kind of see the rankings a little differently, but basically Baby Peach and up. Let me not totally out of it, but not likely to win. So next race here we come. And what's cool about doing Mario Kart okay, like your uploads, unless you like go irate for three stars, each s circuit's gonna be like. Uh, Ooh, cool track. It's gonna be roughly, uh, oh man, so many hidden things. Uh, 20 minutes or so, almost to a T. Is that Woohoo Island on that map? I think it is. I know Woohoo Island is better than anyone. Where is that map? That's like, uh, <laughs> Nintendo DS chat. Man, there's so much to see. Oh, I didn't know if those were gonna give up or not. Mario Kart TV advertising. There's a track here. I wonder where the train. Oh, speak of the devil. And I wonder what's on the other side of it. Huh. As well. Whoa. Good thing I went this way. So this track is pretty complex. It's going to take a lot of time to get uh, into the best paths. Whoa, we got lucky there. <laughs> oh yeah, it's got a bit of a coconut mall vibe to it. Toads in space, I don't know if that's a movie or something. Oh, something's going down on the internet machine. Was that the Woohoo Island map back there, kind of like right in front of the start line? Oh, I totally, I was looking, I was totally reading the signs. That's on me. Alright, let's, uh... <laughs> Was that a uh, Yoshi Valley? That's... Oh, I wanted to go that way. I wanted to see what was up there. My bad. I, I tend to have these problems. Was that Bowser Jr. graffiti? <laughs> Man, this is cool. All right. There's a nice little uh, detour over there as well. I'm just like taking in too much of the background right now. I think is my problem. Oh yeah, we're going uptown, baby. I wonder if you can ride on top of those. Okay, so coming up, where is it? 
Oh, don't hit the wall, don't hit the wall. We got some delfinos there, too. Right there, that was a little map of Woohoo Island to your uh, right. When you hear me say right there, just rewind the video. To the Let's try to go. Oh no! Throw it before it hits. Ooh, first place shells. At least we haven't like gotten spammed with them in this race yet. So we're gonna go this way, see what it's all about. Ooh, speed boost. Back up to ten points. Oh, the answer is yes, and there's a ramp on it. It's kind of like Toad's Turnpike type of a deal. Let's go this way again. We're just going to hug the left this time, if possible. We won't commit to it. And I also, I'm curious, like, what happens if you hit the train? Do you get flattened, or does it just, like, push you aside? I'm going to have to investigate that off camera, I suppose. All right, so final lap here. Da -da -da -da. But you could cut through there if you had a mushroom. We just, you don't get as good of a power up, you know, whenever you're in the first place. Usually, sometimes you do. Alright, so 45, windy, hanging tight, man. Her and Villager still in the running. Villager is officially not going to take our spot. Windy, however, it could. If we have a bad finish and she gets a good finish, she'll, she'll come in first. So, uh, Villager, even at first place, should be 43. So, we're safe there. Let me see what went down. It was Twitter. My phone's green. Da -da -dum. Four new interactions. Ah, it was Tim. Alright, so... Uh, like I said, hopefully these upload with no issue. <laughs> because I think if there's problems, it's like my breaking points. And uh, I'm not even gonna try it again. So, I might do the second channel, like a dedicated channel, and see if they... Well, then I wouldn't have to worry about, like, unboxings and Minecraft and everything else, pretty much. <laughs> you know? This is stuff, like, if you just watch the videos and you don't actually upload yourself, you miss out on this horrible mess. Big Blue, what in the world is this? Oh, cool. Kind of like, uh... It has elements. Okay, so it is F-Zero. I started to say that at the beginning, but I thought, nope, I don't want to say it because I'm probably wrong. <laughs> okay, so A for accelerates. Whammo. Wonder if this will be like Rainbow Roadish, you know? Something like Epic Saga of a track. Sometimes I kind of miss the ones that are like episodic. You know, like instead of three laps, it's sort of like you've got. Ooh, the pink is drawing me in. You sort of have. Oh, I was an idiot for doing that. So the speed boost comes sooner. That one, but you get two here. Uh oh. It's been a while since we've seen that stuff. I wonder if it switches at random or just per lap. I don't like the uh, zero gravity like dictating which lane I need to be in. Because that means it does it to everyone else. <laughs> that means we all have a. or at least the person in the f No! Land before it happens. Throw the banana peel. Shafted it. Right there, and that, okay. It's a shorter track than I thought. No, I couldn't see it. Uh oh, who was that? Was that, that was Mario, wasn't it? Ah, uh, this could screw up our three star rank. Yeah. I used to care a lot about that, now I just kinda wanna play the game. <laughs> you know? We'll find out who it was. Well, no, we won't. That looked like a pink person. So is this an episodic? Oh, cool deal. Oh, I thought I was going to deck right into that. <laughs> Man. You know what I'm thinking. Like, I thought we were going to just drive right into our own funeral. There. Cascade down to the bottom. There's no edge guards here. So I'm going to keep that in mind. Uh, I have no idea which route's best. <laughs> so. No! No! Curse you, Blue Shell. It's just like old times. Alright, there is an edge here. We can really drift. <laughs> that little heart was a nice touch. But you did the trick. Will the coin offset that? No. <laughs> I, I didn't know if it would or not. Whammo! 
Does Lakitu seem in slow motion there to anyone? Kinda thought he did. But yeah, right there, 20 minutes, man. So, generally, you know, if you just go straight completing the races, these run roughly like 18, 22 minute range, which is like perfect uh, for an upload. And it's also easy to crank them out and you get home late or something like that. But Baby Daisy, she down there. Awesome. <laughs> I'll, I'll take it. All right. So again, this is fun, and I I like fun. I don't like complicated or problematic with video games. I have complicated and problematic in the real world, and that's not why you play video games to deal with the same things that aren't fun. You do this to get away from that crud, you know. Oh yeah, can we see the map? Oh, it was you, Metal Mario. I see how it is. Celebrating your victory. What did you have? Seventh place in this race? Ha. Ah, that's right. Me and Isabelle are going places. Probably to the Toad movie after this. Ah, I'm trying to, like, read the sign. Okay. I'm, I'm into that. like the background too much. Alright. World 8. Oh, we did three start. Very cool. I like the uh, pink accent there. It works well with Isabel. Uh, yeah, Isabel in this case. Whammo. We got it done. So this will be part 12. Again, 11 and 12 recorded here in 2016. <laughs> They're going to be retroactively inserted into the playlist. And uh, part 11. Absence and why it's like that. Now, I don't think I ever scanned in the amiibo either. I did not remember this many. The thing I'm saltiest about here is Rosalina. Uh, because I have a life. And uh, I did not get to go there and stock Target early in one morning. And they've never re-released her. They've improved the you know stock on uh, the Amiibo big time. Because there for a while it was abysmally bad. Like, laughably bad. Very laughably bad. And uh, they've kind of, like, reissued a lot. Like, Little Mac, you know, no one really thought he'd come back out. Uh, a couple of the other, you know, relatively hard-to-find ones have been rehashed. But not Rosalina. Nope. All the other people that were store exclusives have kind of re-emerged at all retail. But not Rosalina. And the thing is, you need her in, like, Mario Party, too. And I think in Ultra Tennis Smash. And there's, like, a, there's a market for her. Oh, I did not know Wario uh, had a suit, either. The reason I didn't buy and he's also been hard to find. I think I could have got him a few times online. I've never seen him in person, but... Uh, the reason I never picked him up, I wanted like a traditional Wario like you see in the background there. And, uh, it's kind of, it doesn't look horrible, but like, I don't have space for this stuff, <laughs> you know? So, we'll, uh, we'll make a video where we scan in what we've got, though, but, man, I wish we had a Rosalina. That, that, I'm pretty well, I think, done buying Amiibo unless they make a Waluigi one. Namely because I don't have space for this stuff. I mean, it's it's gotten ridiculous, and I don't like having these, like, plastic containers everywhere, <laughs> you know, in the house. And I'm like, what's in there? It's like, oh, Skylanders from three years ago? I'm like, what's in this one? Oh, that's, that's uh, some Amiibo I don't use often. But, uh, yeah, man, I did not know. The Pac-Man suit looks really cool. But uh, we can do everything here except Wario and Rosalina. So we'll have to do that sometime coming up. Need to do that in uh, Yoshi's Woolly World as well. So let's see if we unlocked anything here. We'll do some Grand Prixin. Just to kind of get it going. Da -da -da. Yes, yes. Hallelujah. No, guess not. So we didn't reach a coin milestone. But uh, nonetheless, I hope you enjoyed this. I did. I had a lot of fun here. And uh, I think where we left off, it was, what, 100cc lightning cup, maybe? Uh, da -da, come on. It seems to me like you should pick your track first. But I guess in the online is where that makes the most sense. But let's see here. So, mushroom. Oh, we only won. Okay. No stars there. So, 
the original eight are what we care about. Yeah, we have not done the Lightning Cup at all, apparently. So, we need to do that, and then the four new ones as well. So, we'll have to get on that. Maybe I'll scan in. You know, before I do it, uh, we're not doing it now, but before I actually move on to these next four cups, <laughs> all right, I'm going to edit these two videos, parts 11 and 12, and I'm going to submit them to the Content Creator Program. They'll get approved, and if Nintendo puts a copyright claim on the approved videos, I'm done. It's going to Twitch, <laughs> okay? And I think I'll poll people if they just want it on Twitch, or if you want like a second channel that's just where I dump Nintendo content. And I do mean dump, because I'm not going to record anything dedicated for it. It's just going to be an export of Twitch stuff. And, uh... I'll, I'll leave that up to y'all, but I have, I'm, I'm being optimistic that it all works, and it's roses and cranberries, I don't even know what that means, no one says it, but we did, so it's a thing now, but, uh, I hope for the best here, because I love Mario Kart, Nintendo puts out, that's the thing, so many developers now put out, like, just day one junk. I mean, you have to, especially if slow internet like me, you don't get to play the game on day one, man. You're downloading the patch. And then it's like, no one knows, like, NBA 2K15? How do you get out of the heat? And you know, it's like, I don't want to replay the finals forever. Uh, there's just so many things that are bad that developers do. And Nintendo, man, they put out some grade A three-star con. I mean, it's good stuff. They put pride, they take it like on a personal level, you know, where other people are like, aha, well, let's wing this and just do a day one patch. Hey, the game isn't anywhere near being ready. Should we, you know, postpone the launch date? Of course not. You know, we'll do a week one patch. Nintendo, it's good to go that day. If there's any updates, it's minor stuff or like cool added features or something along those lines. And uh, those are the things, I mean, I grew up with Nintendo. It's what I care about, it's what I like, it's what I remember from my childhood. But uh, it's all been a rocky road here <laughs> as of late uh, because of their decisions. And uh, I don't know. Like I said, I feel sometimes like they just need to speak to like the grassroots enthusiasts, not these YouTube people with millions of subscribers that don't really care about Nintendo. They're just there for free stuff or promotions. Like, that Splatoon stuff, come on. You know, what did, like, two people actually care about the game, you know? Uh, there's so many people that would be better suited to that. And then there's people like me, which I don't think I'd fall into that because I don't have near the subscriber count to really weigh in and be meaningful. But I will go and these, whoever these people are afraid of, you know, on the North American level, or maybe there's, like, people that stand up and get canned so no one else will... They can't fire me because I'd just be speaking from a fan standpoint. But I'll tell people things, man. I don't care what you think of me. I care more. Like I feel like it's one of those deals where many of the fans have like a better vision for the company and care more about the success. Like you, I don't want to come in here and have like Sony fanboys, you know, be able to say, oh, you know, we we don't have all these issues. I want it to be Nintendo's on the top. And so much of their stuff has just been self-inflicted. And I feel like it's because there's, like, either idiots somewhere in the chain of command that no one stands up to, or the people, you know, that are kind of at the top, like, just censor that out or fire all, you know, the uh, opposition or something. I mean, because power corrupts, but absolute power corrupts absolutely. You know, it's, it's a very, very big problem in... Uh, the corporate world, even across something along these lines that you wouldn't necessarily associate it with it at first glance, but uh, I'm that guy, man. I'll tell them <laughs> where they're going wrong because I'm the guy that cares that much. You know, it's, that, so it's like the Skylanders. When I critique like the upgrade paths, it's because it's I care. I wanted it to be better, you know. But uh, Anyway, I won't go again. Part 11, the beginning, like, eight minutes, I kind of cover that stuff. Explain why we haven't done this in, like, a year or whatever it's been. But uh, 
keep your fingers crossed there's no issues and I'll get back on this thing we'll go through the rest of the 100 cc stuff which I guess we got like five cups now to go through uh, we'll go through 150 uh, we'll do everything it'll just be a lot of fun and uh, I look forward to it so uh, that said again uh, we'll kind of pick up a little rusty still here especially on the controls it'll kind of come back to us in time um, do you agree with me though? Would ZL and ZR not have been like a way better choice than that? I'm gonna see if we can customize that sometime. I'll also, if all this goes well, I'll scan in the amiibo. That'll be a standalone video. And uh, we'll try to make the most of it. So, uh, once again, going forward, uh, hoping that we can here on the YouTube upload side of things. It'll be back to the basics. We'll come in here, Lightning Cup 100cc. We'll debate a little bit too long about what character to use <laughs> and then we'll go have the track uh, do our four races have some fun and move on with our lives so I look forward to it I hope that's how it pans out and uh, if not we will proceed accordingly and there will be a channel update regarding the matter so uh, stay tuned I hope you all had a great Valentine's Day hope you have a good President's Day and I will catch you back here somewhere hopefully here on YouTube uh, for more Mario Kart 8. So, as always, your support is appreciated. I hope you enjoyed it, and I will catch you back here, uh, hopefully for some more good times. We can't do Mario Kart 8, by gosh, we're gonna we're gonna up the Skylander ante. So, stay tuned.